We are back. <laughs> it's been a long time since Carlo has joined me on this amazing uh, journey journey of live videos. So I'm just going to give it a moment until people pop on. And Carlo's going to give me a makeover. I should have shaved my face. Mm. People like real, hun. People like real. We're going real? People like real. All right. No, don't take off your shirt. Keep your shirt on. <laughs> Keep your shirt on. <laughs> Hi, Emily. Hi, Tanya. Oh, Tanya's on. Shit's about to get real. <sighs> right, Tanya? Hi, Hillary. Oh, our internet's been poo-poo today. Has everybody, anybody else experienced that today? Like, oh, no. Hey, Stephanie. Do we, ladies, do we look different? You guys aren't used to this, right? Like, you guys aren't used to us looking. I think the last time we did a live, my hair was darker. Wasn't it? Yeah. Let me just adjust this. We've got a new lighting system, which is awesome, but the iPad's not picking it up very well tonight. Not picking it up. Why do I look cross-eyed? Because you are. Can you imagine walking around your whole life not thinking that, but you really are? Like, wait, say that again? Like, I never realized that I look kind of look cross-eyed. Or maybe it's just... Maybe. I think it's the angle. Maybe. Move the lights in here. I don't know. Okay, so Carl's going to give me a makeover. I've given him an array of options. Um, I'll walk him through it. If he doesn't know what to do with something, we'll see how he does. I know what eyeliner is. I know what lipstick is. I know what uh, primer is. Do you know which one the primer is? <laughs> the one that says primer on it? <laughs> <laughs> I know it's probably creamy, right? That's foundation. There we go. The one that says face primer. That's the one right there. All right. Stephanie says you don't look cross-eyed. Okay, thank you. Stephanie, do you have a crush? Just kidding. I'm totally kidding. She told me to be real, but she won't let me take my shirt off. I don't want you to be overly real. All right. All right, so Carl's going to get started. He's going to take a shot first. Because apparently putting makeup on his wife's face is, like, alcohol needed. No, I was sleep sleepy. I need to wake up. You guys ever get that with kids? You go to put your kids to bed and then you just want to go to sleep? Because that's what just happened. Carl's popular. He's getting phone calls from his other girlfriend. Mm-hmm. one okay. number. That's where you get the action. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, and do you want to start with, like, do you want to do my eyes first or do you want to start with, like, the Flawless Four kudos? Why don't you explain the kudos and I'll... I'll uh... So the kudos for the month is the Flawless Four. So it comes with our foundation, liquids concealer, perfecting concealer, the liquid foundation brush, and the face primer. So these three items are the, normally the cost of what the four items this month are going to cost. So essentially you're getting the foundation for free. Did you, is, is this something that you named it the Flawless Four? No. No? No. This is what Unique named it. Okay. Hi, Jess. I need to figure out this lighting. Like, this is still very new to me. I feel like, okay, you ready? Yeah. Okay, so this is the Flawless Four. So if those of you have like popping in and they don't know what I have going on right now, I need to sell 10 of these and Unique is gonna send me a makeup trunk. But I don't want to incentivize myself, I want to incentivize you. So if you order a kudos through me, go on my website and buy one of these beautiful babies, you will be entered into the draw to win the makeup trunk if I get all 10 sold. So. Oh, it's the same number. They really want a piece of Corrado tonight. Hi, Krista. We have to answer the phone or like stop the phone because it's upstairs in our room and Leo's sleeping. So we may get interrupted. Yeah. You gotta love telemarketers, right? Our favorite things in the world. Telemarketers at 812. 
on Thursday. What happened to the day when they would call just at dinner time? Now they just call later and later. Because dinner gets later and later, right? Stephanie, we're a little old school. We have a house phone so that we can get cheaper internet because that's the deal. For real. Like, legit. If we didn't have a house phone, we'd still have to pay the same price but a little bit more, which is totally ridiculous. But anyways. All right, so Crotto is going to get started. Can I use a brush to do this or is it better to use my hands? It's better to use your hands. All right. Am I doing your whole face or am I doing... Do you want to just do half my face? What do you want to do? Um... <laughs> I don't know. I feel like the wheels are turning in there and I don't know how comfortable I had a rough this. day today. I did. I had a rough day today. I'm going to chew this gum. Have gum? No. Oh, shit. Rare. Epic fail. I don't see the point of having a cell phone either, Stephanie. Friends no, don't no. even call that either. Mm -hmm. For the whole face? Mm-hmm. Do you want to explain to the the people's watching how this feels? Like, what is the feel. texture feels? It, what, what is the texture feels? You know what I'm trying to say, the man. <laughs> Stop being it, ass. It feels, um, it's actually making my, my hands super smooth. So I can imagine what it's doing to your face. Well, my hands are on my face, so you can probably answer that question. And it's not, it's, I thought it would be sticky. It's not sticky. It's like, I don't even feel it anymore. Is that what maybe, it's supposed to do? Yeah, maybe if you put some in your hair like this with your hands wrapped, like the residue, it'll make it grow. How much is left of this thing? <laughs> Got extra bottles upstairs. Oh man, it's funny. All right, what's next? Um, it's this foundation. Mm -hmm. This I use a brush, right? Foundation brush. You put this all over your face? Foundation? Yeah. How did you grow up with a mother? How do you not know this? And like you watch me put this on every day. How seriously? Who puts foundation only on parts of their face? I don't know. Today, ladies, I'm just gonna put foundation here and here. I'm like I so said, I can be off color. I had a pretty hard day today. He just June, he just finished putting on the primer and now he's gonna put on the foundation. Is that too much? No, you can navigate how much you want. It's buildable. So the products are buildable. So with the foundation, it's water-based and it is thin. So you can put thin layers on and you can um, build it. You can do layer and layer and layer and layer if you want to. Okay. Circular motions, Carlo. Oh my goodness. What are you doing to look, me? Can you look at me, please, instead of looking at yourself? Thank you. You're enough looking at yourself all day, okay? <laughs> For Christ's sake. So being a jerk. What? Just because you had a bad day doesn't mean you have to try to ruin everybody else's. I'm spreading the love. I work from home too. I'm not that cranky. You're supposed to do it in circular motions. You're going to okay. wreck the integrity of the brush. Okay. Can you look at me instead of looking over? It's hard to look, for, look at you when your knee is digging into my thigh. Like, what am I supposed to do? Just be like... I feel very claustrophobic right now. <laughs> Am I supposed to go real up here too? Mm -hmm. Your mustache area? Mm hmm. Okay. It's a lot like painting the walls. <laughs> I've been doing a lot of painting lately. What do you right? <laughs> So. Thank you, hun. Thank you it for is. suggesting that, like, paint, you dig my face is like painting the walls. I need to get the cutter. Where's the this? tape to, like, so you don't get it in places that you shouldn't? Can you look at me, please? It's hard to look at you when you're, like, pulling my watch, face. Watch the hockey game. I don't want to watch the hockey game. I think the Leafs are a bunch of... Winners? Poo-poo heads. I don't know if I did a good job. Or, did I do a good job? I don't know. You won't let me does look. It, does it look bad? Well, it's not perfect, but you didn't do bad. Wait, I gotta do your nose here. Aunt Cora says you could do hers. Dom says what up. Apparently we're really funny. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay, what's next? Concealer. This goes under your... Go under my eye bags, or like if you have blemishes, I don't really need it anywhere else on my face except for my eye bags. Okay. And you put like... 
The teeniest tiny amount because it's I know, spreads. I know, I know. And there's a special brush for this too. Or do I use the same brush? You use your. You can use your finger to dab it on, and then you can use a blending bud to put it in. That's enough. That's on your fingertip. It's good that you're covering up my bags since you you help cause them. It's good. Which, which end? The pointy end. You dab it. What's in there? You were wiping it, like swiping. I'm not swiper, no swiper, swiping. Swiper, no swiping. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> okay, not so bad. Laura says you're so delicate. I know. Hi, Sarah. Yes, Stephanie, we can be friends. Not, I'm not a Leaf fan. I mean, the jerseys are nice. The colors are nice. I'm just not a Leaf fan. Okay, so he just put the Flawless 4 on me. He did a pretty good job. I mean, I can do better, but he he's doing a good job. I'm proud of you. Thank you. You're welcome. You can get a cookie. In okay, case so we've done, what, two out of three now? Three out of the four? We need one more? No, the fourth item is the four. This oh, is okay. the four. So you prime, foundation, cover up. So now what, the I'm still afraid to do your eyeshadow. Why? Because I always screw up on that. Well, I'm not letting you do eyeliner, so it should be for the easy. I okay, also gave you... Is Laura Polak related to the Toronto Maple Leafs defenseman Roman Polak? Hmm? You're always trying to look for a leaf person. Okay, so you can use these. These are the pigments that I chose. So I chose, I think this is Sassy. Yeah, Sassy Mineral Pigment. It's very close to your nail. Eh? And Naive Mineral Pigment. Mm-hmm. Can you use other or? And then I chose palette number three. God, this is the worst part, I'm so. Why is it the worst part? If Dawn can do it, you can do it. And then you can start with my brows too, if you want to do brows. So the, I also brought the brow palette. Okay, and which brush is it for the brow? This is for the powder part, this is for the wax. You do not have to use the wax if you don't feel comfortable. You could just literally use number one and then that's it. Number one is this one, right? Number one is that one? Yeah, number one is one that's labeled so number, number one. one. Yeah. But don't you want it to be the same color as your hair, like blonde? No. So you want the carpet to match the Kayla face? says that you and Chris, shush! <laughs> Um, Kayla says you and Chris should talk because he loves the leaves. All right, come on, Corrado. My hubs is taking pointers. Show him how it's done. Be appropriate now, wasn't it? Oh my God! Why do you gotta turn it that way? Like it's a makeup tutorial, not a passionate tutorial. This is not a pure romance party over here. He's like very strategically putting this on. It actually feels sort of relaxing. It just, you know, it just looks like you're, <laughs> like look. <laughs> it's okay, this is your work of art. Yeah. That you're gonna paint me the way you see me, so if I look stupid, then you look at me like I'm stupid. Maybe because I need a little bit more. <laughs> Charlie, it's time for bed. She's trying to sneak down here to get on the live. Oh my god, it really does look like I'm raising my eyebrow. I'll fix this. Oh boy. You gave me an arch. Isn't okay. that what people Whatever. pay for? Whatever. So focused. Such a dirty mind, Stephanie says. All right. You don't know Shane. Stephanie's getting to know me. She knows me well enough right now. Here's the scary part. Okay, so you could do blush too, but I think you should focus on the eye first. Okay. And then... This is the scary part. Why? Because I always make you look like... No, you do that when we're playing a game and you're trying to be funny is when you make me look stupid. Can we do something like not so crazy? You don't have to be crazy with the eyes. Okay. could be like, what you expect me to... You think that I'm expecting you to do some like 
Yeah. No. No? No. You can do whatever you want. Okay, so what brush do I use for that? For what? You have for these. the mineral pigments. You can use a deluxe brush. You can use any brush, really. So just a little bit? Yeah. Do I need anything else to add to it? Not if you don't want to. Okay. That, that's too much, it seems like. Definitely if you want. Here goes. Yes, I do, June. We sell, we, I sell like everything for makeup. Um, I can show you the website. I'll, I'll message you the website. Um, but you can go to letsgetliplashed.ca and check out all the stuff we offer there. It actually kind of feels like you're massaging my face. It kind of feels nice. You're good. Are you still nervous? No. Oh, I'm, it now? no I'm you're good now? Yeah. Okay. Now what? Well, you can pick it up. Are you just going to do gray? No, I'll do another one. Can I use a different brush or do... You can use the same brush. You can do a different brush. You can mix it up. Whatever you want to do. Hmm. It's, like it's way more pinky on this side than it is on this one. Because mm, you probably got most of it on that left side and then... Sort of like the residue on the other. Yeah. What do you ladies think? <laughs> He's missed some parts. <laughs> it's okay though. If he was really good at this, um, I'd be a little worried because this whole time I've been trying to learn how to do my makeup and he could be showing me would have been like mind blowing. Okay, this, right. this could all be a ploy, you know. This it could be. This could be. Okay, it's mascara time. Gel, then fiber, then gel. Mm-hmm. You gotta put the gel in your hand first. Do you do top and bottom? Fix the arch carado, see? <laughs> Stephanie is on you. I don't do the bottom. I just do the top. Close your eyes. I'm going down, okay? <laughs> no, you don't do the second eye first. You have to do the first eye com complete first. Or else the gel's going to dry before you put the fibers on. And I already got like a piece of something stuck on the bottom there. Do I have to put the gel again? Yes. Woo! Not so bad. Not so bad. It's very quiet. Oh, you're not talking. So how about those leafs? Oh God, he really wants to watch the game, so he's gonna speed through this. I'm not even. And speeding. then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fix it up after he goes over there to watch the leaves because he really wants a piece of that action. Sorry, just poke your eye there. Wow, pretty good, hun. Ashley says, I'm brave. <sighs> yeah. I'm not doing that bad, am I? I had, I had three kids, so I feel like having three kids is a little bit more scary than letting him just attempt the makeup. What's next? Is that it? Um, there's blush and there's lipstick. Blush goes on here, right? On your cheekbone. Do you go up like this? Mm. Is that what you do? Mm-hmm. I'm a little bit this worried that you don't know this. 
Well, why, why would I notice? Because you sit with me when I do my makeup all the time. I thought you would have, like... You told me to leave you alone, and I leave you alone, right? That's not true. Look at me. When I'm speaking to you. <laughs> you want to do this the old-fashioned way? <laughs> and I'll squeeze them? No, pinching? Yeah. So, ladies, when he's done this, I'm going to take a picture of his work, and then I'm going to show you how to fix it. How to totally disregard what I did in mine. Oh, my God. Is that bad? It's not amazing, but it's not terrible. Do I get to sign you, like, a piece of art after? Can I autograph the top of your head? No. No? No. I didn't do that bad on the cheekbones, did I? I did pretty bad. It looks beautiful, Corrado. Thank you. I like Stephanie. I'm afraid to let you do this lipstick, but I'm gonna let you try. This is um, Ambitious, oh. one of our new colors. Okay, I'm gonna turn here. Are you nervous? No. I can say lots of bad stuff right now, but I'm not going to because I'm a gentleman. <laughs> Here, let me fix it. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. Let me fix it. Okay. You need some, like, nice big... Not that bad, is it? Mm. I'm not gonna do it. Well, it's not horrible, but I probably wouldn't, um... Walk outside the house. Walk outside like this. I wouldn't. Um, but I say good job. Can I please sign? Your face. No, I'm gonna show them how to fix it. But this is a you can show them how the shine wipes work or the foundation works after I write on your head. No, okay, I don't want you to write on my head. I know the silence tells it all. Okay, ladies, I'm gonna still make him sit here and I'm gonna fix it. I'm going to fix it. Are you ready for me to fix it, hun? Let's see. Let's go fix it, Felix. Mm. I'm going to use the same products that he did because I don't want to be fair. I don't want to, like, totally cheat and get new products and be like, what? I never even knew that it existed. I just wanted to let you know, guys, that um, this was all planned from the beginning. So I was supposed to do a job like that so she can show you how well this make makeup Why works. are you lying? You're <laughs> such a liar. Oh, boy. It's all just an act. Thank you, June. All right. Crado likes to... Crado likes to get a rise out of me. For some reason, he likes when I get all riled up. I think it's because he grew up with an Italian mother who used to yell at him. So he likes to keep the momentum going at home. He's got some sick, twisted, demented thoughts. That's for sure. It's okay. Oh, boy, hun. Let's go. Let's let's see you fix this. Fix it, Felix. I'm gonna brush these out first. And shade some of that color. Ugh. Hey, I didn't get to use that tool. Um, it was sitting standing in front of you. You said in front you, of you. That's a comb, not a brush. But it was sitting in front of you. It wasn't. It's not like I went and left and got it. This is also sitting in front of me, but I didn't use this on your face because I know <laughs> that you're not <laughs> supposed. To. Oh my god. <laughs> He's purposely trying to be a jerk now. I don't know why. I, don't, I know he's had a bad day, so, like, I'm getting the brunt of his bad day of him being, like, a crazy pants. All right. We should have taken a before and after picture. Oh, I was supposed to. I didn't do that. I'll, I'll snap it from, I'll snap it from the video after. You know? Mm-hmm. He's, uh, 
he just wants to get into the hockey right now. Like, you can see the excitement, the anticipation. I can feel the anticipation in his leg because it's touching me. That's not my leg. But, oh, my God. <laughs> Dear Lord. Ladies, note to yourselves, if you're trying to do a live and trying to get your business running and you have your husband come into it, make sure that you kind of discuss what you're going to say beforehand or else you're going to get a lot of this... Uh, this is the tequila talking right now. Yeah, apparently. Apparently it's the tequila. Mm-hmm. All right. Oh, Lord. I'm going to fix this. Felix! Oh, shit. I'm going to use palette 3. He did not touch palette 3 even though it was sitting in front of him, but he used the mineral pigments. You told me to choose. I did. I did tell you to choose. See, this is an unfair comparison because... You're not fixing what I did. You're doing something totally different. I'm not doing something totally different. I gave you the products. I didn't get off the table to go look for something else. You're really trying to get me going. <laughs> Stephanie wants to know if it's Patrons. Um, I don't know, actually. I know it's si something silver. Something silver. Hey, whatever's in the cupboard, he just pours it. Yeah. It's kind of like his M.O. I should watch your videos, personally, from start to finish, and practice, and then one day you're just going to be like, oh, we're going to do live so you can make my makeup look like blah, 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 and I'll totally blow your mind. I highly doubt it. I am Brooke. I am adding to his handiwork. He didn't do a terrible job, but if you let your husband do your makeup and it looks not, um, leave the house worthy, I'm just showing you how to fix it. I could tell you that I personally know many people who have gone out of their house with worse makeup than that. Well, I know people who personally do the same thing, but I'm not one of those people, so... And I'm pretty sure half of them are my friends. <laughs> All right. Oh boy, I'm missing all these comments. Oh no, I'm not. Hi Madison, hi Crystal. If you're just joining, I'm fixing up Corrado's uh, handiwork on my makeover. So we went from, we're going from drab to fab, fab I guess you can say. Fixing it up. I'm so glad you guys can see this properly now, rather than rather than it being like this yellow lighting. Fix that after. <laughs> Did you like my whistling? Fantastic. I'm gonna whistle you Your to sleep. Pitch was perfect. He's obviously the drinks are getting to him already, because he's being an ass, and he's not usually this assy. Alright. We should have a party. No. We should... No, I don't want to clean up that mess. Outside. We should have a party outside. When it's nicer outside. I did not do my lipstick, lady, so if you're popping in and you're like, what happened to your lips? I didn't I didn't do the lips. She's totally lying, guys. There's a lot of people who have been... Now you're looking more class than a piece of ass. <laughs> So I'm just taking some eyeshadow and I'm lining the top of my lid. Oh, hon. Mm -hmm. I didn't do eyeliner. Yeah, I didn't really need you poking me out. <laughs> I think that would have been a disaster. No, I did last time and it was all right. Yeah, you did a better job on the makeup last time. It's because you weren't drinking last time. I actually, I was drinking last time. No, you weren't. I'm just a little rusty. Come on, it's been a while. How long have we done a live? It's been a long it's time. It's been a while. Two months? Mm. I think it was like January or February. Probably. Okay, ladies, I fixed my eyes. Now I'm going to fix... Her life. Um, yeah, <laughs> fix my life. <laughs> 
All right, so he put a lot of blush on here, so I'm just gonna take the blusher brush and kind of blend it in a little bit more. Holy my jolly son. It's a lot of blush. It's okay. I forgive you. Thank you. It was just enough to. I helped you out. Oh, you started the you started I, the canvas start, for me. I did right. Okay. All right, let's fix up the lip. The you just expanded, you know? It's like today's music. So you used a classic and embellished it a little bit. That's what you did. Mm. I need a wipe. You really did a great job on the... Thank you. I appreciate it. The lips here. Thank you. I wasn't getting an actual compliment. I'll take it whatever way I want to, but thank you. This color is super nice. It's a nice color. Now I'm going to put on this lip gloss that was sitting right here that he didn't use. This is Lucid. It's a nice little pink shimmery color. Again, you said do whatever I want. And that's what I did. There we go. So I fixed up his work. I probably should have taken a photo, so I'm going to have to backtrack on this um, live and take a screenshot and then do it that way, right? Yeah. So I just fixed it. Didn't take that long. What do you ladies think? Hearts? You know Hearts? what that means? That means I didn't do that bad of a job, right? It, I, I'm just trying to make the point that anything is fixable. <laughs> no, it's not. What are you talking not, about? Well, maybe in makeup, but yes. What did you think I was talking about? Oh my god. Seriously. It's like driving me crazy. God. There we go. No, I <laughs> nope. I need to make it better. <laughs> Anyways, how does it how does it feel? Being the husband of a successful woman in DS marketing. Fantastic. You're being a smart ass. I'm, I'm, I'm not. I'm, I'm really, serious. I'm really not. It's, it's good. We get to work together at home. But that's fine. We have lunch. We have lunch. We pick up the kids together. We do. S what else? We go out for lunch. <laughs> Would you say... We have coffee during the day. Would you say... Would you have said, like, nine months ago when I started that we would be here like today and seeing, like, like us being so happy? Or was this unexpected it was when I took this risk? Um, I didn't think you were going to get this far so fast. Pretty far. Mm -hmm. Pretty far. We're aiming for... We're going to try to skip orange and go right to purple. And then black. And black is the highest level. You're my favorite color right now, actually. And purple is your favorite color. Yeah. So. So I don't want to be orange because I feel like I don't even know how they determine the colors. Like, how do you go from like pink to blue, really pretty colors, and then green? That's a pretty color, and then orange, and then you go back to pretty purple. I don't, I don't get it. But anyways, so to the ladies who were watching who are not part of unique if you had to give them one thought about you know joining my team what mm -hmm. would it be you need to put the work in do you think that this is a scam or a scheme it's not a, it's not a um it's not a scheme at all um but you definitely do need to put the work in it just don't expect things to come to you it's just like anything else it's like another job, but right. you're like this sort is of, a job. You just this is your office. You're, it's it's the same as like going to work, except for your every department. Mm -hmm. So you are payroll, you are sales, you are marketing, you are HR. You're like everything by yourself. You get to, and, and I think that if you work harder, um, how can I put this? So you can work another job, and it could take you, you know. 10 years to get to boss, right? Right? And there really is no way of you controlling to becoming to that boss within 10 years. It's kind of like 
you know, you have to have to be so many hours and blah 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 blah, right? In this way, in this this job, or I don't even call it a job; it's a career. Mm -hmm. um, you can you can be well, you start off being your own boss, kind of, mm -hmm. but um, you can be a successful boss in six months. Right. So June, what did what made you start? Um, this actually was a whim thing for me, to be honest with you. Um, I bought the starter kit because I thought the deal on makeup was good and like legit. Like a week before, I had purchased two hundred dollars worth of makeup from Mac and got like four items. I got four items, paid two hundred dollars, and I thought that was a good deal because it was high quality products, well known products. And then I was introduced to Unique, and I thought to myself, well, for one hundred and twenty dollars. For getting all this I have got nothing to lose because I'm pretty sure I've spent way more than that in just random drugstore products so I basically just signed up to get the makeup because you can do that you can sign up get the makeup and just like run away and be gone um, but I got to know the women that are part of unique part of our team that I just kind of fell in love with and I kind of got into a groove with and then it was kind of narrowing down for me going back to my job because I was on maternity leave at the time um and it was a job that I used to love and I was really successful and I was really good at but it boiled down to two things daycare costs are ridiculously high and I no longer love that job like getting up in the morning to go to that job was like nails to a chalkboard for me like I loathed it and it didn't it didn't help me be a better person so when it was time to go back to work um i talked to Crotto and i just sort of wanted to see where this was going to take me because it was presented here like i was already a presenter i wasn't really active in it but i th thought like i have nothing to lose like i got this makeup i might as well just try to see what happens and i've promoted several times since i actively started to pursue this which was october of last year i joined in july but i actively started to pursue this in october and i hit an elite status last month nine months right well i've been with the company for nine months but it only took me five months to get to an elite status so i'm pretty like it's pretty exciting because you get to meet like all kinds of new people and you get to I'm on social media anyway so I get to play on Facebook I get to you know grow with you guys watching me and it's it's just a lot of fun like I haven't really had any downfalls I have nothing bad to say about what I'm doing I mean I hear a lot of negative things about direct sales but I think it's just because there's a stigma that surrounds things that are not considered normal so you know when you are younger and you go to school you're taught to like go to school get an education get a nine-to-five job get a career you know work really hard and retire but with direct sales you know you don't need a career for, I mean you don't need a college degree for it and it goes at your own pace and you can do it from home do it whenever you want to and I think that really scares people because it's not something that when you're in school you know you're not in grade four and they say that you have to take this major test so that you could work on the internet like they don't tell you that they still try to skew you into like that college university mode which is totally fine but you know i think that's the most difficult thing is trying to make people understand that it's more than just you know a scam it's not a scam i can show you my bank balance any scam anyways well, thank you everyone for tuning in to our quirky live. It's been a long time. I would like to do this more with Cardo now we have proper lighting where we don't look so yellow, which is fantastical. Um, so if you ladies have anything you'd like to see for our next live, um, let us know. I think we're going to do makeup trivia, which is we're going to ask each other questions. And if we get it wrong, we get to do whatever we want to each other's face. How am I going to get anything right and how are you going to get anything wrong? It, when I say makeup trivia, I talk about the, putting the makeup on, not that the questions are going to be makeup oh, trivia. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. So it could be things that you know and then things that I know and then we have to test each other. So I don't know. But if you ladies have any cool or awesome ideas, you know, Crotto is open to pretty much anything. He'll put on any kind of makeup because he's that secure with his sexuality and with his manhood that he does not need to, like, cry and get a weird out by makeup. 
because real men embrace makeup. Just saying. Right, hun? Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in, ladies. If you have any questions, drop me a line. Like and share the video. Thanks for tuning in and have a good night.